hello 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 <laughs> and good morning and welcome to the vlog starting out at the parking lot <laughs> at the bank I needed to get something done Ugh. and then now I need to go and drop off this somewhere and then head back home and start parking because we are traveling tonight to New York technically to DC but we are flying through New York just because the prices to DC were a bit ridiculous <laughs> so yeah we'll just be in New York for five hours we could say that we're going to New York for breakfast <laughs> it, could, it could seem that way anyway that's the plan I haven't packed anything at all the flight is tonight there's a lot to be done for someone who's traveling I am leaving as if I'm not traveling <laughs> anyway um, welcome to the vlog I don't know how this vlog is gonna pan out since yeah life is a little chaotic now but <laughs> holy smokes we'll see I don't think I'll have a separate travel vlog with all the crazy crazy effects or whatever it'll just be a normal weekend vlog even if in a different location that's kind of what I'm feeling like I don't feel like doing the most with a travel vlog anyway yeah so come along let me go drop this thing from the bank and then come back home park figure out our life for travel and then we go to New York for five hours and then to DC we come back on Wednesday so today is Saturday I don't know if I mentioned that so we leave Saturday night get to DC on Sunday we're taking the bus from New York to DC <laughs> it's a very interesting um, travel itinerary if I do say so myself and then we come back from DC on Wednesday we are flying directly from DC that's the plan I think it might be a week vlog so I might end it next weekend but we'll see we'll see it depends on how much I actually film anyway hi if you're new here hi my name is Florence welcome um yeah let's let's do this life thing then <laughs> oh I need directions <laughs> so I'm gonna uh, abandon you guys I'm back home now sorting out my travel packing situation picking outfits trying to pack very light so deciding what to wear with what I park yeah and I'm gonna park and I'll probably see you um, when we are headed to New York probably yeah I'm trying to decide which fragrances to bring with me and I've settled on a few <laughs> uh, for a three-day trip four-day trip depends on how you want to look at it I've settled on this oriental cherry from dossier which is basically a dupe of tom ford's lost cherry mm. i wore this the last time we were in dc so i don't know i want to make the scent association with dc and then i'm carrying this thumb down which like i've mentioned a million times on this channel is a woody fragrance sandalwood cedarwood for the man's it's almost over but yep and then i'm carrying tiny samples as well so i'm carrying this uh you probably can't see the name but <laughs> what's the name again Terre de Amez. i don't know how to pronounce that it's supposed to be an orange and vetiver fragrance very fresh apparently great for spring so i'm carrying it as an alternative to tamdao for the means and then for myself, alternative, I've carried diptychs or rose. Is there a way for it to be visible? Uh, not really. <laughs> so travel size, almost done. I really want a full bottle of this. It's like a fresh watery rose. Very pretty. So I think it will be nice for the days I want to smell fresh. Because this is deep and sweet. And then the last alternative is a tiny sample of Baldafrique by Bayredo. It's a very interesting scent, one that I want to gift myself. It smells very 
happy and sunny i don't know how to describe it but yeah so three scent options for myself too for my partner those are the fragrances i'm bringing <laughs> a bit excessive some might say but um if it was up to me i would bring more <laughs> but this will have to do yeah it's my tiny scent collection for the cheap i'm actually done packing the clothes and other paraphernalia i'm only left with devices like laptop chargers headphones what else masks what else have i not packed oh i need to pack some medicine i like to travel with medicine so like painkillers tummy medicine you never know so yeah, i'm gonna carry some ibuprofen and some tummy medication i might carry either this one i think this is a nice tiny one Time to head out. Hey. Good, good.
Hello, DC. <laughs> oh, it is freezing cold. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, it feels good to be back. Made it to DC. Quick room tour. Front door. There's a coffee station over here with some uh, coffee supplies. There's no. a fridge down there. There's a closet in here with some robes and other paraphernalia. Turn this way, go into the washroom. Toilet sink, mirror, another mirror. <laughs> and then there's like some linen situation there. And then the shower is right there in a strange cubicle. <laughs> and then you go this way. And this is where the bed is. So there's a big mirror. We love a big mirror, a big TV, a desk, a nice bed, lots of cool lights. Like even the desk has lights. There's pink lights up there. <laughs> there's so much light. Another weird mirror. And then a view of a courtyard, I guess. But yeah, that's DC. We ready. today it's monday morning actually it's more like afternoon i think it's 12 30. i just finally left bed it's been a very lazy morning yeah i don't think i did a very good job vlogging yesterday i just made coffee i think you saw that and i'm gonna have that with some cookies that we bought and then i'm gonna have some fruit and that's going to be breakfast um let me see let me fill you in on what happened yesterday <laughs> i don't even think i did a very good job vlogging so yesterday we flew to new york right <laughs> for breakfast right <laughs> no really that's the only thing we really did in new york so we got to new york to the took the train to uh, midtown and then went to times square and walked around i don't know new york was quite underwhelming i don't know i think i expected more so yeah it's, it isn't like bad it's just first of all it's dirty <laughs> i don't know if, if anyone has ever mentioned this in their travel videos or whatever but it's dirty there's trash everywhere i don't know <laughs> oh man. also it was raining when we went it was drizzling the entire time so maybe that caused my impression to kind of go like this I've decided I'm going to give New York one chance. Like, we'll go there for a proper trip, three days or something, no expectations, and see how the city feels. <laughs> anyway, so we got there, went to Times Square, and then what did we do? We took the bus uh, towards Central Park to catch breakfast. So, yeah, so we initially wanted to go to Blue Bottle, I think it's called Blue Bottle Coffee, but. Um, they didn't have dining and it was raining outside so we didn't want to have to walk around eating i mean the breakfast part was supposed to be relief from the rain so we ended up just going to starbucks so much for flying to new york for breakfast so so much for flying to new york we left starbucks in seattle to go get starbucks in new york <laughs> but for those who don't know starbucks was founded in seattle so we like literally left the home base of starbucks Anyway, so we went into Starbucks, we bought coffee and pastries. I ended up not liking my drink. I, I got the matcha latte. 
I didn't like it much and I've had that drink before from two different coffee houses and I've made it myself once as well but there was something about this one that I didn't like anyway it's fine uh, we had coffee and pastries and then we walked towards Central Park it was, it was drizzling at this point so not too bad Central Park is also not very interesting also I think the time we went was not interesting it wasn't very green i don't know in my head it was supposed to be very green and luscious which i guess it is like in june or july in the middle of summer but we're coming out of winter so the trees don't have leaves everything is kind of gray and not very i mean i feel like seattle is more green than than central park even at this time of year you just have lots more green and anyway <laughs> We did a small stroll around Central Park. We didn't walk the entire park. That's just way too long. We didn't have that kind of time. And it was drizzling. Then night began raining. So we made our way back to Times Square because I realized I didn't get selfies. And then uh, went to McDonald's and bought some food for the go, for the trip. And then we took the bus to where now our bus stop to DC was which I forget where that was. <laughs> yeah, and then I got onto the bus and came here. We got here maybe 5 p.m., took an Uber to the hotel. Um, I think as I did the room tour, and then from the room tour, I just kind of disappeared because I was tired. I was a girl was sleep deprived. I slept on the, on the bus here, which is rare. I rarely sleep when I'm traveling by road. I like to look around and see everything. I slept a lot. I think I slept like three quarter of that trip. <laughs> By the time we got here, I was still sleepy. We ate our McDonald's, and then maybe at like seven p.m. we were like, mm, I don't know, we might get hungry at night. Let's find something to eat. We also needed to buy some supplies, not supplies, like groceries, things like this to have for breakfast because we don't want to pay for breakfast. So we went to Whole Foods. We bought some cookies, we bought some food for dinner. I bought some fruits. We bought some water because they only give you two small bottles of water and I I blazed through water like I'm being paid. <laughs> so we bought one nice big tub of water. Yeah, and then came back home, watched something on the laptop. Uh, and then that was it, I blacked out. And <laughs> here we are the next day. So hello. I have been rambling for five minutes. You may wonder, what's the plan for the day? There really is no plan. <laughs> we came to DC because the man's had commitments and he has commitments the whole of today and Wednesday morning. We leave on Wednesday afternoon, evening at like 5 p.m. So technically today I'm alone and I can do whatever I want. And then to tomorrow we have a full day together then Wednesday, that's basically a gone day because I won't wake up early to do anything. We've also been to DC before, so we don't want to see the touristy things again. We've already seen all those. Though we might go check out if the cherry blossoms are still there since it's spring. So yeah, I literally have no idea what we will do tomorrow. Um, <laughs> I need to think about what place we can go see a whole day. <laughs> or we might just decide to stay home. I mean... When you visited a place once and seen the many tourist spots, the next time you go, you, you kind of start looking for, I don't know, things that locals do. Because <laughs> the tourist things, the, the novelty has worn off. So, yeah, that's, that's what's happening. I might go to the mall, maybe people watch, do a bit of shopping. I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to have my breakfast, eat my fruit. And then I will catch you when I leave the hotel room. Hello, hello, hello. I finished eating breakfast, chilled, showered, and now I'm ready to go, you know, outside and explore. I'm just wearing a normal top jeans. <laughs> I have this sweater. Ugh. It's supposed to be the sweater of the trip <laughs> for layering in case it gets too cold. And a black jacket. Basically, I packed very minimally. I only packed jeans, variations of tops, 
and then this and this will go over everything depending on how the weather is and white sneakers <laughs> yeah so i think i'm gonna go to the mall now um let's go see what it is like outside hopefully it's not too cold we outside i'm out and about out and about i think this is so charming so charming. I love it. There are so many churches here. We must K Street. Lovely. Little birds chirping. Love it, love it. dressed people. I love it. <laughs> so clean as well. How cute. <laughs> I think I kind of like this scene. <laughs> so pretty. Honestly, the mix between those old charming buildings and the newer ones is so cute. So, so cool.
Good morning. Oh, there are a Thai place here. And a Chipotle. Okay. Time to find some breakfast. Cute flowers. Hunting for breakfast and it's drizzling. you on Wednesday at 11.44 I have like maybe 15 minutes before checkout um, yeah this is the end of the trip <laughs> I'm going back to Seattle today I just need to check out I'm already all packed um, and then maybe head to the airport or maybe get something to eat first before heading to the airport yesterday it was a very chill day I don't think I spoke to you much but I think I vlogged some bits and pieces we went for breakfast in the morning came back chilled um, then stepped out later on in the evening to go see the cherry blossoms of the tidal basin but we were too late they'd mostly shared so <laughs> it was just a walk that's all it was and we went back for dinner at the same place where we were the previous day some thai restaurant i forget the name yeah we just had dinner came back and yeah that was it <laughs> that was, it was a very chill day it was cold and gloomy it was raining so yeah we didn't do much plus we'd already seen all the touristy stuff before so except the cherry blossoms which we actually didn't end up seeing there were a few on the trees like very few i think i think i took a small video you'll see but they weren't as beautiful as they're supposed to be when they're at peak bloom i'll insert pictures of how it's supposed to look at peak bloom anyway um yeah that's kind of the update today is wednesday we leave for home we get home pretty late tomorrow is a working day for both of us so i don't even know when i'm gonna see you again probably thursday morning before i go to work Probably. I think so. I don't think I'm going to vlog when I get home at night. <laughs> I'll be exhausted. Anyway, um, yeah, I guess see you the next time I see you. <laughs> and we're ready. Goodbye, room. <laughs>
for flying with us this evening. We hope you've had a pleasant experience and we look forward to seeing you again on another United flight. Welcome to Seattle and have a great evening. Hello you guys. Happy Friday. It's almost 4 p.m. on Friday. I haven't picked the camera up since Wednesday. I think the last thing I filmed was at the airport when we got here. Anyway, we got home safe. Of course, I didn't vlog. I was tired. I just came and went straight to bed because the next day was a working day. <laughs> Yesterday, I didn't go to the office. I stayed home. I worked from home. Not very productive, to be honest. I was struggling with jet lag. This whole thing of flying between time zones and my body, they just don't agree. Like each time I change time zones, it takes me so long to adjust. Anyway, so that was yesterday. Today I also stayed home and worked from home. It was a bit more productive today, thank God. I am just about to go to the mall, <laughs> to Sephora, to smell some perfume that Instagram has been shoving ads down my throat about. It's a Jo Malone perfume. It's a limited edition. Um, it's a spring, freshy, floral kind of perfume, which is something I'm technically looking for, which is why it's piqued my interest. It's a Jo Malone fragrance. It's called Sakura Cherry Blossom or something of sort. So yes, yeah, so I'm curious. And they keep showing me that ad like one million times. I might as well just go smell it. <laughs> Plus my birthday is coming up next week. And I still haven't decided which fragrance I'm going to gift myself. So... Might as well go smell it and see if it's worth it. If so, I'll add it to my short list and then I'll pick a fragrance off my short list and purchase it for myself for my birthday. <laughs> That's the plan. This vlog has so much shopping. Actually, even the previous one, right? The previous vlog is where I did the... Why? I showed you guys this sweater. It's a lot of shopping. I really don't shop this often, by the way. It's just It just happens that... <laughs> season i began vlogging is the season where i'm buying things but i normally don't buy things often anyway yeah so that's the plan i'm gonna go to sephora i'll smell it if i like it we'll see we will reassess and decide what i'm going to purchase yeah what else is happening i think i'll end the vlog after i get back home from sephora and then maybe start a different weekly vlog Next week is going to be crazy because we are moving next weekend. <sighs> so there will be a lot of packing and anyway, that should be interesting. <laughs> also, my birthday is next week on Wednesday. So hello. <laughs> that should also be interesting. I don't exactly have plans yet, except I know I'm buying myself a fragrance or two or three. Who's counting? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's the plan. Let's go to Sephora, smell this Jo Malone fragrance, and see what's up. I don't have any other plans in the mall, to be honest. So I'll, it's just a quick dash. I'm literally just going to the mall to Sephora to smell that fragrance and maybe a few other fragrances. And then I leave. I don't think I have anything else that I want to check out. It's a lot, a lot later. I think the last time I saw you guys or I picked up the camera was at Sephora on Friday. Yeah, that, that was Friday. Today is Sunday. <laughs> so I smelled the perfume at Sephora and I ended up liking it and ended up buying it. But I bought it online, so it's not here yet. Maybe when it shows up, I shall let you know, maybe give you a small review, tell you my thoughts about it and why I purchased it. But yeah, that happened. Um, yesterday was a very busy day. Lots of errands. Today's another busy day. We're helping our friends move. And basically, that's the end of the week. I think I should end this vlog here because next week is also super hectic. We are moving next weekend. So there's going to be a lot of 
things happening <laughs> this coming week also my birthday this is also this coming week so there's lots of things happening and i might i might vlog this coming week so yeah i should probably end this vlog here and then maybe tomorrow i will open up the new vlog because i don't think i'm going to film anything for the rest of the day <laughs> anyway yeah that's the end of the vlog thank you for hanging out with me um i'm not even sure what this vlog was about oh wait so the, the new york and dc vlog oh wow can you tell my brain is all over the place i had even forgotten that it was this week that we went to dc <laughs> what a chaotic week it's been <laughs> Anyway, um, yeah, I guess this is not a very representative week in my life because I don't fly to New York and DC every week. <laughs> it just happened that the week I was vlogging, that's what happened. Anyway, yeah, um, I keep saying anyway. <laughs> Guys, let me just go. My brain today is just... It's not it's not it's not having it. So I will see you in the next vlog. Thanks for tuning in. Love and light. Bye.